He just asked me questions. What kind of questions? Questions about sex. What did he ask you exactly? Well, like, maybe I don't want to tell you exactly. So you're gonna let a total stranger videotape your sex life and you don't even want to tell your sister? Apparently. Did he ask you to take off your clothes? Did he ask me to take off my clothes? No, Anne, he didn't. Did you take off your clothes? Yeah, I did. Cynthia! What? Why did you do that? Because I wanted to. You don't know where that videotape could end up. I mean, he could be bouncing it off some satellite or something. There could be some horny old men in South America watching it. He wouldn't do that. You don't know for sure. Well, it's a bit too late now, isn't it? Did he touch you? No. I mean, but I did. You touched him? No, and I think, no. Uh, I touched me. Don't tell me you. In front of him? Yes, Anne, in front of him. You're in trouble. Listen to you, you sound like mom. I mean, what are we even talking about here? I can't believe you did that. Why? I can't even do that in front of John even. Well, you can't do it, period. You know what I mean. You don't even know him. Well, I feel like I do. That doesn't mean that you do. You can't possibly trust him. He's perverted. He's not perverted. He's, I don't know, he's harmless. He's just some guy that sits around and likes to look at these videotapes. So he's got this catalog of women just touching themselves and that doesn't make you feel weird? Well, I don't think that they all did what I did. You are in serious trouble. I don't understand why this freaks you out so much. You didn't do what I did. And if it doesn't bother me, then why should it bother you? I don't want to discuss it. Well, then why do you keep asking me about it? 